when John's away, if he's like playing a gig with his band or something, I often just make myself a steak and egg supper. It starts out with a jalapeno and onion and garlic cooking up in a little olive oil or vegetable oil. I put in about a teaspoon each of chili powder, cumin, and coriander. I want this to have a nice smoky flavor to it, so I'm using one can, a 14 ounce can, so about two cups of diced fire roasted tomato to balance with some sweetness, one small can or eight ounces of tomato sauce. And then for that smoky heat, I puree one can of chipotle and adobo. These are dried peppers in vinegar and spices. I puree it and I put it in a little baggie because you only need about a spoonful for each of your recipes, right? A tiny drizzle of honey or agave. And I love one little tiny pinch of ground cinnamon in my ranchero sauce. You mix this all together and let it stir for the flavors to all combine. I let it bubble away for about 15, 20 minutes and throw my tortillas in the oven. It's like a giant brunch nacho. See you later. Okay, back at the ranch, we're going to cook up a couple of steaks. You want six to eight ounces per portion. You're gonna season this liberally with salt and pepper. I'm gonna get the steaks going. When we come back, we're gonna talk about eggs right after this. When you bake up your corn tortillas, they get super crispy. And then to cheese or not to cheese is up to you. But of course, I chose to cheese because the whole idea of steak and eggs is a reason to eat a breakfast nacho. Uh, when the sauce is done, I just turn it off and add a squirt of lime. I'm gonna flip our steaks. For your building of your rancheros, I'm gonna reheat some refried beans. I still buy the spicy vegetarian refries. And I thin them out a little bit, add a splash of water while they're heating up just to get them going. And then I jazz them up with a little cayenne pepper sauce. I like Frank's Red Hot. And a little um, cumin, which we already put away, but I'll grab it. A little sprinkle of cumin, a little hot sauce, and some lime if you like. And then back here, for your eggs any style, cook the eggs over medium heat. And to avoid flipping them over and just for a really pretty plate presentation, once the butter melts, crack the egg in there and put a lid on the pan and the egg will cook to up, medium, or even well. It's beautiful, you never have to flip it and it plates up just gorgeous. Um, the steak is about ready. I'm gonna take one last quick break I get an egg in there when the butter melts. When we come back, I'll serve this up. It's gorgeous. Don't miss it. I just put a little lid on it, and the eggs are perfect. A little salt and pepper cooked in a touch of butter. So here's how you roll. You put down your crispy corn tortilla. You top it with your spicy refried beans. And then we're going to top that with our ranchero sauce. Top that with our egg our crispy steak alongside with a little wedge of lime. Adorable for our steak. And we're going to top everybody with some pickled jalapenos. Yeah.